What is up guys, Jared Campisi. Welcome back to the channel. No, this, this uh, title is not clickbait. Ducati actually sent me a 2020 Diavel 1260S and I'm super, super excited for this one. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. All right, so what is going on? Well, Ducati hit me up. They said they were interested in having uh, Christina and I film some videos with some bikes. They sent me over Diavel 1260S to ride and film and have some fun with for a few weeks. They sent Christina a Super Sport S. It's actually on its way here. It's not here yet. So uh, we're gonna be doing some dual vlogs, all kinds of fun stuff, and uh, I'm really, really excited. So uh, today my buddy uh, Rupp just showed up. You guys have seen his uh, chopped R1 Street Fighter build. Um, but he's actually going to be riding our BMW today, which is our next build series bike. We're going to be giving this bike away. You guys know the drill. You can check out the Patreon page if you're interested. But uh, he's going to try out the S1000. I'm going to try out the new Diavel 1260S. And we're just going to go for a ride and have some fun. Get this, guys. 0 to 60, Ducati claims, 2.5 seconds. So it's one of their fastest bikes, one of the fastest Ducati production bikes ever built. And, uh, and it's technically a cruiser. So, I mean, it's kind of like mind blowing what this thing is. It doesn't really have any competition. So it just kind of sits in a class all of its own. And uh, man, I'm excited. I'm gonna have this thing. We're gonna be filming all kinds of fun videos. So uh, let's start it up and see what this baby sounds like. So, first ride on this bad boy. I hear Rupp coming like a maniac. <laughs> Guys, the amount of torque this bike has is so out of control. <laughs> oh, how do I look on this bad boy, Rupp? That looks actually really good. I, I was kind of skeptical before, but that looks pretty awesome right now. When it's moving, right? It's such yeah, a muscle bike. And check it out, I can do this on it. Dad, you just took off from like, you were going 60, you went like 120 right there in no time. It's fucking the torque. So 160 horsepower, 100 foot pounds of torque. I'll tell you what guys, I love sport bikes, but there's something to be said for the fun factor on a motorcycle like this, dude. It is a, it's a hot rod. It's seriously a hot rod of a motorcycle. Right, let's go. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, this is where I saw the cop yesterday. Yeah, this thing is crazy. And it's only faster than the S1000 because that can't go over 8,000 right now. No, dude, you literally you were way faster than me right there. You just <laughs> took off. I was I was almost full throttle, you know, obviously because it's still breaking in. Yeah. And uh, you just took off right. <laughs> <laughs> Low end power, man. That's where this thing I'm oh telling you. Ducati claims 0 to 62.5. I think it's probably right, dude. Wow. You know? Yeah, this thing is crazy. And the handling, too. And it's so comfortable. I can't believe it. I thought I'd be getting a lot more wind than I am. But there's like a little pocket right here that I can just huh. kind of hide in. When you're uh, running hard, you just kind of tuck in like this. Yeah. It's fucking badass, dude. It, I'm, that bike has actually grown on me. It, it looks pretty dang cool right now, too. Yeah, I like it, man. I, I love the Xeavel. You rode the Xeavel, right? I did, yeah. yeah, yeah. You liked that one, didn't you? I, did, I, I liked it. it. That one had to grow on me as well. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's a totally yeah. different type of bike, right? You know, it's, oh, a, yeah. it's, a, well, yeah. it's a new Everything's market. Different. Like, yeah. I'm actually getting used to this bike being up on the street bike again. Yeah. So everything's different. Because you yours is so chopped bike. up, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah. So guys, if you were following me on Instagram um, a few weeks ago, we actually had to be evacuated because of a fire. That is the area right there. This is part of all of that, that burned right there. Freaking crazy. And our house is like a mile down the street. So 
freaking wild to come up here and see this. So this is the 154. We're going down up, up, up over out of Santa Barbara into San Inez. Some of my favorite roads of all time, dude. So I think we're going to take you guys to Paradise Road today. And then in another video, we'll have to go to Zaka Station Road. It's a bunch of wineries out there. It's just freaking stunning. And of course, it's 75 degrees in the middle of December in Southern California. I apologize to everyone who's watching this in uh, 20 degree weather in the rest <laughs> of the country. <laughs> So Rep and I were just chatting, he was talking about the S1000, that's the first time he's been on that bike. And he said that uh, the throttle feels very disconnected, it got a little bit cheap, and even yeah. the seat, he said he doesn't like the feel of the seat. And that's funny because in my first ride I mentioned both of those things. That's one thing that Ducati always does really well. The things that you touch, the, the, you know, the clip-ons, the handlebars, the, the brakes, the, uh, the seat, uh, the foot pegs, all that stuff, it feels so premium on this bike. It just feels so good, exactly how, you, how it should feel. And, um, you know, there's a reason why Ducati has the name that it has, you know, and they're, they're known for having premium products. It's little touches like that, you know, that go a long way. And man, I got to tell you guys, I'm super comfortable on this thing. I got torque for days. <laughs> I'm loving this thing. Nice, dude. <laughs> Look at this puppy, dude. Oh my God. Yeah, the peg clearance is pretty good. This thing can rip, dude. <laughs> Look at that. Oh my god, I'm surprised I'm not getting more wind doing stuff like this. It actually feels pretty good. Oh man, I wonder what the speed... <laughs> okay, alright. Alright, let's slow it back down. We gotta let Rub catch up on the S1000. <laughs> okay, alright. <laughs> I gave him a neutered bike. <laughs> you do look badass on that thing though. Alright, let's test out the brakes on this hog. Actually, I don't even need it because the freaking engine braking is so good in sport mode. Let's see the clearance. Wow, dude! <laughs> oh my god! This is ridiculous! <laughs> Do you see how this thing just takes off? It is crazy! How are you doing back there? I have this. Trying to catch up, man. Putting I keep, along. I keep hitting the rev limiter. I know, this is so annoying. <laughs> Alright, let's see how the handling is on this bad boy. Oh my god, I wish I could film this. Woo! Oh my god! Dude, this you are ripping on that thing right now. <laughs> it rips so hard, dude! <laughs> Be careful. What the hell is going on? The suspension is so good. So if you buy this bike, definitely get the S model, because that Olin suspension soaks up the bumps so well. Dude, I can't believe the clearance on this. There's the front wheel floating. <laughs> you are absolutely ripping it, dude. I've actually never seen you go this fast before. It's so fun. <laughs> oh my God. Careful, dude. It's so confident. Oh, rocks, rocks, rocks. Yeah, careful, man. This shit's fucked up down here. <laughs> I'm like so worried about you. <laughs> <laughs> you rough rides like this all the time. He never sees me ride like this. It just I feels. Literally, I literally have never seen you ride like this before. It just feels so good. I don't know what to say. <laughs> oh my god, you are pulling away. <laughs> I'm so surprised by this bike, dude. I think I could ride this bike faster around uh, around the roads like this than I could on a sport bike, no joke. Dude, you are, I, I've never seen you go this fast before. Just because of the riding position. Alright, 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 alright. Let's calm down. <laughs> I was scared for you. Let's calm down. <laughs> How does it look from the back? Dude, I wish I could do video. Like, it was, it's amazing. Oh, we gotta get you a GoPro on your helmet, bro. Oh, uh, yeah. Here, why don't you hop in front? Let's take a look at you. There we go. <laughs> I have no worries to keep up. How does that bike feel? Uh, it feels, you know, less than a 600. Yeah, you know? neutered, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, dude, you look good on that thing, though. 35 on this turn. But the whole point is... This bike can keep up with leader bikes. That's Oh my god, dude, you're you're kicking my ass. Yeah, like on normal everyday roads, not on a track obviously, but for carving canyons with your friends and stuff, you can totally rock this thing. Yeah, why not? And it gives me more confidence knowing my back tire 
is 240 millimeters, you know? It's like if you hit some gravel or you hit some dirt, like normal road riding, it, it's yeah. like, it's a lot more confidence inspiring, you know? I've got like twice the size of a sport bike tire on this fucking thing. <laughs> and it still has plenty of clearance. I mean, I'm ripping this thing pretty hard and I'm, I haven't scraped pegs yet. Dude, you were absolutely ripping at that <laughs> And I, dude, the suspension just soaks up all the bumps. It's crazy. And you don't even have to change your riding position. <laughs> you just stay sitting in a chair. <laughs> Sit back, drink your coffee. Yeah, it's crazy. Well done, Ducati. Hats off to you. Well done. Red limiter. <laughs> oh, you look sick going into those turns, though. I will say. Wow, the torque on this thing, dude. Yeah, the suspension is so good on this thing. Fire station. I'm gonna slow down. Yep, fire yep, 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 yep. What an awesome road, man. Wow. All right, so my GoPro actually died. I was gonna do the sign out on there, but uh, I was having too much fun. <laughs> Honestly, guys, uh, there's my first initial reactions to this bike. Um, I actually like this a lot more than the XD Oval. It's much sportier. You can rip on this thing. As you saw in the footage, Rupp is a badass rider. And the fact, well, I mean, the bike's neutered, but still, um, this, thing's, this thing's insane. I'm really, really impressed with this bike. And thank you, Ducati, so much for sending it out. I have a lot more videos coming on this thing. If you guys have questions, things you want to know about on this bike, drop them in the comment section below. I've got it for a few weeks here. I'm going to be making all kinds of videos and I'll take into consideration anything you guys want to know. Try to answer any questions you might have if you're interested in picking one of these up. But honestly, I would say just go test ride one and bring your checkbook because <laughs> it's freaking amazing. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to hit that thumbs up button, subscribe for more, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Oh my god! <laughs>